We're going to be begin our board meeting today with a bang, literally. And uh, the first item on our agenda, we, we always have presentations, and our first is a certificate to recognize the Westfield High School Marching Band for being invited to participate in the Rose Bowl Parade on January 1st, 2014. This was requested by Supervisor Fry. And uh, Supervisor Fry, I will recognize you for uh, to read a certificate. And, uh, and then I understand that we have with us the director for the Westfields High School Marching Band, Stephen Penoff. And he has uh, some folks who are with him this morning who are going to get our meeting started right. Supervisor Fry. Uh, Madam Chairman, the, uh, uh, this is uh, truly a, a, a pleasure. Uh, to be able to do this, the Westfield High School Marching Bulldogs are the uh, only the third Virginia band in history and the first Fairfax County band ever to be asked to participate in the Rose, Tournament of Roses uh, parade. So this is really quite an honor. Uh, they uh, had a brass quintet playing out in the forum, uh, playing some holiday music for us uh, uh, and for the enjoyment of all those that are in the building. And uh, they have... Uh, given the fact that the marching band is 275 strong, uh, we didn't think it would fit. And if it did fit, it, you, we'd all have our eardrums blasted. So they have formed a, uh, a mini band, uh, and I uh, understand uh, mostly it is uh, the seniors that have worked so hard to bring them to this point. So I will move a certificate of recognition uh, be presented to the Westfield High School Marching Bulldogs for noteworthy musicianship, marching ability, uniqueness, and adroitness to perform field show maneuvers while marching, resulting in an invitation to participate in the 2014 Tournament of Roses Parade in Pasadena, California. And I would move approval. Second. Moved by Supervisor Fry, seconded by Supervisor Hudgens. Uh, let's and vote. Uh, go ahead. Well, I was going to say they, they are ready to come on in and perform, if we, and then perhaps Perfect. we could. We could speak to Why don't we, we will speak uh, after we have the band come on into the boardroom. Outstanding, and I understand that if we ask nicely, there may be an opportunity uh, to hear another number. We, yeah. we would love that.
That was fantastic. And uh, at this time, I would ask if band director Stephen Penna could come on down to the podium. And, uh, and if we could have, I believe, members of the band come on down and, and, as well. And Madam Chairman, we also have with us uh, uh, Tim Thomas, the principal, um, Terry Tolles, the director of student activities, and Kathy Smith, our Sully District uh, school board member, if they could come on down. Come and, on down. Uh, we, we put a motion on the floor, but we didn't vote on it. If I could speak to it, Madam discussed. Chairman. Um, just uh, briefly, what an amazing accomplishment uh, this is. You know, if, if we could only get the U.S. Congress to work so well together <laughs> as the, the band did. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, uh, I'm not sure exactly who had the idea that uh, uh, that going to the Tournament of Roses parade was, was uh, something that not only should they seek to do, but, but that they could do. Uh, but they, uh, you know, the, the, the band parents and, and, and the director and all of the kids, you know, bought into the, uh, into the idea and put uh, together uh, their application. Uh, it was a multi, multi-month process, um, but uh, they were successful. And, and I guess maybe that was just the start, because not only did they perform on the, uh, on the, the field, uh, but they also had to raise uh, well into six figures to, to um, send the band out there. And, and I know uh, uh, they are still gladly accepting contributions. If <laughs> anyone feels yes, so, <laughs> so compelled, um, I don't know how many car washes they've done. You wouldn't know it from looking at my car, but I had, uh, I had quite a few done uh, over the last year. Uh, but it, uh, it really is just an extraordinary accomplishment. Uh, and, and I understand it is all about the kids, to all 275 of them. Um, thank you for narrowing the, uh, the group to come and play uh, this morning. But uh, it is also about the band leadership, and that starts, uh, it certainly starts with the administration, um, uh, but it comes down to, to uh, uh, the band director and the senior leadership uh, in the band to, to put together uh, 275 students um, all different ages, different experiences, um, and different l levels of, of commitment to bring them together as one with the, the, the total commitment uh, to perform as one single marching unit is, is really truly just a, uh, an outstanding uh, accomplishment. And so every member of the band f should um, truly feel uh, proud for, for what they've done. I know your parents are. We have many of the parents that are, are here today. Um, it, uh, it, it's been an, an amazing uh, journey, and uh, it's going to be even more amazing. Hopefully, Steve will give us some idea of where they, they will be slotted so that we can plug our televisions in. I, I, I can assure you I've never watched an entire <laughs> Tournament of Roses parade, but, um, but, but I, will, yeah. I will be yeah. on yeah. January 1st, 2014, that's for sure. So uh, it is, uh, it, it's a pleasure to have you here. Uh, today to, to, to send you off to tell you how proud uh, the, the, certainly the entire Westfield community and all of Fairfax County is uh, for your accomplishment and how proud we're going to feel uh, when we see you coming down, uh, coming down the street with, with literally hundreds of thousands watching uh, along the route, but uh, millions and, and tens of millions nationwide and, and around the world. Um, not that that's pressure. Yeah, no pressure. <laughs> <laughs> so I will tell you a few statistics to, to qualify that. Uh, it's a million people that watch the parade live in Pasadena. There are 50 million in the U.S. audience alone and over 300 million people that will watch it around the world in 222 countries this year, broadcast in 26 languages. So wow. um, it's a big deal. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it is a big deal. We, uh, we, we know have you will do some us more proud. Discussion. Supervisor Hudgens. Thank you very much. Uh, Mr. Fry uh, has well uh, set the tone of the excitement that you bring to the, uh, the board here in the community. And I, I just want to say uh, a congratulations. Westfield shares some boundaries here. And uh, I think we want to say congratulations to the entire community, all of the families and, that supported it. And I just want to emphasize, I think, one piece that he said 
that this is representing Fairfax County, and that in doing so, I think we should work really hard to get you quickly over the top in terms of what you need for fundraising, because I think it is something that it's not the Westfield community, but it is the Fairfax County community. So I hope we'll all be given some clues as to exactly the easiest way we can do that, because I think we want to send them off to enjoy and you to be really relaxed that it's all gonna go off well. Thank you very much and thank everyone for what, what they do in order to give such an experience to our kids and to let others see what uh, really they can accomplish too. Thank you. Thank, thank you very you. much. Thank you, Supervisor Hudgens. Uh, does anyone else wish to be recognized, Supervisor Hyland? Do we just give our checks to Supervisor Fry? Fry. That, <laughs> you that, may do that, so. That that you want to get. Is that? <laughs> can he collect them for you? Yeah. Mr. Cook, my condolences. Uh, you know, yeah. for your we district. Have, we, under, we understand. Oh, yeah. oh yes. We oh, understand maybe, maybe that Westfield is uh, has a lot to be uh, pretty excited about today. In addition to the uh, to the Rose Bowl. Uh, but uh, but your win was someone else's loss. <laughs> yes. uh, mainly uh, Lake Braddock. You know I me, Madam Chairman. I was not going to mention the football <laughs> game on Saturday, but but, uh, but since you did, it was an incredible uh, football game. I, I hear it was uh, exciting. I will be eating free, thanks to my colleagues, uh, probably through budget. Uh, <laughs> Well, so Super Fries or Fry, we could always turn those lunches into contributions to the Westfields Bank. I think that's a wonderful <laughs> idea. Congrats, yes. What a great suggestion. I, I'm, I'm game for that. What a great suggestion. I have one final question. Supervisor Hyland. Uh, do I get charged full price for my smart car to have it washed, or is it only, <laughs> it's only good? Uh, yeah. So if we give the checks to him, that's okay. He's yes, your sir. agent. You Terrific. got it. Thank you. All right, with that, uh, all those in favor of the motion to approve say aye. Aye. Opposed say nay. That motion carries with the chairman voting aye. Uh, we're all really proud of you. Uh, and I, I think all members of the board are going to be watching the, the Rose Bowl parade, uh, and we'll be looking for you, and we're, you're, you've made us proud. With that, uh, Director, do you have something you'd like to share with us? I just want to thank the board for recognizing us this morning. Uh, this has been a journey that started back in the fall of 2011. Uh, the application process took six months to complete, uh, and over 125 bands applied nationally, of which they selected 10. Wow. Um, I do want to say, as just a educator, a lifelong educator, lifelong residents of Fairfax County, uh, born, bred, and raised in the state of Virginia. As an educator, I applaud you for recognizing these kids and I encourage the board and our own school board to continue recognizing these types of accomplishments. And these kids, if they had um, been caught with drugs, been caught you know, drinking and driving, they'd be on the front page of the paper. And it's a sad statement when we don't put these kids on the front page of the paper. And I applaud you and really appreciate, as a lifelong educator, the opportunity to recognize their hard work and talent. So thank you very much. I do want to thank my friend and principal, uh, Tim Thomas, and my friend and uh, director of student activities, Terry Toll, who has really supported us through this whole process and the volume of parents that you mentioned without which we could not have achieved uh, our dream. The, the, the theme of the parade this year is dreams come true with music. And so the pieces that you heard will actually be played at the parade. The first piece is an original composition entitled Dreams Come True. And so uh, with our community's help, our dream is gonna come true that we'll be in Pasadena on January 1st. Thank you again for recognizing us. Uh, Supervisor Fry, thank you for your efforts and we surely appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Steve. And I think uh, is is school board member Kathy Smith still with us? She was okay. Please come on down. And Can the kids come on down? Yes, and let's figure out how to do a photo. <laughs> <laughs> we can do this. We can do this. So if uh, if okay. you could have the kids come down, Bill will help to arrange you. And Supervisor Fry and I will come out front. The rest of the uh, of the board will do the scrunch. This will be a challenge. Yes. We need to have this high school basketball chair and we need to have this high school band set up to perform at the World Place and Fridays. Oh, yeah. <coughs> so I've got the energy. 
Congratulations again to the Westfields High School Marching Band, and we will all be watching on January 1st. So congratulations again. Our next presentation.